it going guys? Sharblox here. Welcome back to yet again another episode of Roblox Accessory News. Yeah, it turns out Roblox is uploading tons of stuff at the moment and I have a lot of interesting stuff and tons of accessory and event leaks to show you guys. I swear my last accessory news video was only like the other day. Yeah, three days ago. That was about lead clothing, random accessory updates, which didn't really make sense. Go and watch that video if you haven't seen it yet. But the first news for today's video is about these bundles because they finally got officially released. Yeah, I'm sure you guys have seen these already. I think there's like nine of them in total or something. But this is how you go about getting them. I want to show you guys a tweet here from the official Target Twitter account. And if you guys don't know what Target is, it's actually a clothing store over in America. Or it's not just clothing, is it? They sell like food and stuff like that. We don't have Target in the UK. But Target said, introducing your next adventure, the Roblox Avatar Collection. Select shirts come with a free matching virtual shirt and limited edition accessory for their Roblox Avatar. Anyway, they posted the screenshots and uh, and they said look good in the real and digital worlds. I guess this t-shirt here isn't too bad. It's not really anything that exciting is it? Maybe the Roblox stuff would be a bit more popular for the little kids. I like how they left the um, transparent background in. That's kind of cool. I noticed that quite a few of you guys are super angry about this or you're like angry at the fact they're only available in Target. Like this guy here Galactic Spring. He said bruh only available for US targets and not the UK? Are you kidding me? Sharkbox what do you have to say about this USA exclusive shirt. So yeah, it seems quite a few of you guys are actually kind of angry at Target because yeah, these shirts are only available in America. Here they are on Target's website anyway. I'm not gonna lie though, they're not really anything that exciting and most of these designs look kind of horrible. Let's just have a quick look at some of them. Okay, so they're pretty cheap. If you're a little kid, you can buy one of these ones. They were like $10 each. That's really cheap actually. Yeah, that's not too bad at all. I guess these two are okay. This one's pretty cool. If I was eight years old, I'd love this one. What's this? We've got girl shirts as well. I guess the stripey one is okay. And what's this? Young adult shirts? Would that be me? I'm a young adult. I've never seen any clothing company call their shirts young adult shirts. It's normally just like adult shirts, isn't it? So yeah, it is in men's like adult sizes. I really don't like this one. I would not be seen dead wearing this, if I'm being honest. That's my personal opinion though. If you guys want to buy this, go for it. You know what, guys? I can't be too harsh. This one here is actually pretty sick. Obviously, I wouldn't wear it now. But if I was a little kid, I would really like this. As you can see, that's how they work. You buy a shirt, you redeem a code, you get the shirt on your Roblox avatar, and you also get the accessory. I'm sure you guys know about these already, but over on the Roblox avatar shop, we also had the Brit Awards accessories. Five of them are free, so the sign, the pendant, the statue, the backpack, and the helmet. These ones are all free, and if you guys would like to get them, go ahead and watch the event tutorial video over on my channel. These three accessories right here are kind of Brit Awards accessories. Well, they're Pink Panther S accessories, but anyway, big up to her. Shout out to Pink Panther S, not like she needs it. But if you would like to support Pink Panther S, maybe you like her music, you can purchase these if you want to. Just very quickly, guys, since we're on the subject of the Roblox Brit Awards event, you see this person, Bestie Yes, whatever their name is, I don't know. Basically, they're a Roblox admin. They have the official admin badge over on their profile, and I'm guessing this was like the main person behind the Brit Awards event. Anyway, long story short, they did something kind of strange over on their Roblox groups, because look at all of these celebrities. CK, Tom something, I'm not too sure who that is. Glass Animals, Brie Runway, Jax Jones, the Brit Awards, I think they like in other groups as well. So yeah, Lil Nas X, Ty Verdez, Zara Larson, Poppy, a few others as well. Dolo tonight, I will get onto that at the end of this video. Well guys, they also made this group called Test Bestie Yes. And check out the description of this group because it's kind of crazy. And yes, it's about the Brit Awards event. They said, view the meet and greet schedule below and mark your calendars. We will be shouting out private server links here as well as in the artists groups when the meet and greets begin. The meet and greet are first come first serve based on server capacity. Be sure to take pics with the artists and share on socials using the hashtag Brits on Roblox. So yeah, that's kind of mad. Is that happening right now? I'm on the official group and I don't think it is. So I've got no idea how we go about meeting these celebrities. But yeah, fair enough. That's kind of interesting. Maybe that was like a scrapped idea or something. Next guys, the hovering UFO hat accessory was finally updated. It no longer has a code name, so it's got like the real accessory name now, Hovering UFO, and this item now has a description, get ready to take a trip that's out of this world. I'm sure you guys have seen this accessory already, it's pretty sick, it's got some like really nice visual effects. To be honest guys, I still don't know how you would go about getting this. Is it an Amazon Prime item? It's definitely not an event item. It's either like an Amazon Prime item or a promo code item, maybe something else. I mean, we still don't know for sure. And like I was saying at the start of this video guys, yes, we do have a load of leaked events to take a look at. So the 
first leaked accessory is this, the Super Bowl LVI tiara. I don't know what LVI stands for. I'm guessing it's something to do with American football, you know, NFL, Super Bowl. I mean, yeah, that would make sense. It literally says it on the crown. But this item was leaked around 14 hours ago. The description of the item says, a tiara crowned with diamonds and jewels commemorating Super Bowl LVI. This accessory was uploaded by an account called Melonvalk, and apparently, guys, this event is starting tomorrow. Now, I don't know how true that is. I mean, we had the David Getter event, then we had the Brit Awards event earlier today. So really, this event is going to start tomorrow? It seems a bit soon, but I guess we've got to wait and see. I think this is the game place as well. It's called Placeholder by NFL. 100 favourites. I don't know if this is actually the game or not. Updated one day ago, so it could be. I'll be sure to link this in the video's description anyway. Okay, never mind, guys. As I was editing this video, the game got updated, and yes, we were correct. NFL Tycoon. This is the brand new Robux NFL event with free accessories. And there is now a load of these items over on the Avatar shop. They're not currently out yet, but I guess they're going to be out fairly soon. I think these four in the middle are going to be free, and these two might cost Robux. I'm not too sure though. We can tell that this one is free though, via the item's description. Next up guys, we have this accessory called King Hair, and this is actually part of a Roblox Chinese event, so a Lobu event. I'm sure some of you guys might recognize this already. Anyway, it was leaked about nine hours ago, so this one is very new, and it doesn't have a description just yet. The interesting thing about this accessory is it's made by the official Roblox account, so yeah, this is definitely going to be free. Oh yeah, guys, take a look at this character. As you can see, he's literally wearing the cap and the hair as well, of course. So this event is all in Chinese, but it's called Atu Lobu Auto. I still don't know if I'm pronouncing that correctly, but oh well, who cares? So yeah, this event is all in Chinese. I made a video on this ages ago, like a few months ago. I was showing you guys how to get all of these prizes for free. The thing is, this event is still very popular. There's like always people playing it, trying to get the free prizes. So yeah, that's pretty sick, I guess. I also noticed, guys, it was actually updated four days ago. So yes, new free prizes coming into this event very soon. Next up, guys, we have these leaks. Only found it two hours ago, but these items are from Vans x The North Face. So yes, two brands collaborating together to release items on Roblox. I actually really like both of these brands, especially The North Face. Their jackets are really nice. But anyway, the first one, Vans x The North Face helmets. It's a hat accessory. The description says, the limited edition Vans x The North Face helmets hit the park, learn new tricks, and be one of a kind with this collectible. So I'm guessing, guys, that means this item is going to be limited. New Roblox Limiteds coming soon as well. This next one is called Vans x The North Face goggles. The description also says it's limited edition, and they yet again say it's a collectible. So yep, I guess this one is also going limited. And the final one, guys, maybe there will be more in the future, I don't know. But this one is called Vans x The North Face snowboard, and yep, as you guessed it, this one is also a collectible. This one looks pretty sick, actually. I do like this one. And we're thinking this game, guys, Project London. This might be the new Vans x The North Face event game. However, we're not too sure. It's made by a group called Project London, and over on this guy's profile, as you can clearly see, he is wearing a load of Vans merch. So yes, very interesting. We will have to wait and see what happens with this. This guy is in a ton of groups as well. Two Project London groups, Project Venice, the Vans group, the Nike group. It's kind of mad. And I just found out, guys, over on the Avatar shop, that Vans have uploaded around five new items. So we've got a backpack, a beanie, different types of beanies, some sunglasses as well. I doubt these will be free, but we can wait and see what happens. Funnily enough, I actually saw a tweet about these North Face items from Lily. She said the new Vans x The North Face Limited's coming soon, and the official The North Face account actually replied. I'm kind of surprised considering these items are leaked, but yeah, that's kind of interesting. Guys, you're not going to believe this, another Roblox event got leaked, and this one is by Allo Yoga, which is like a girl's kind of like yoga brand, so I guess they do like sportswear, like yoga pants, t-shirts, caps, random stuff like that. Is this even an official event? I've got no idea, but it was updated like an hour ago. And yes, this is the creator's official profile. So I know, guys, it's mad. Another possible Roblox event to add to the list. This one might be quite funny as well. Could you imagine Roblox avatars having to do yoga to get like an event prize or something? I don't know, guys. That seems a bit weird to me. And like I said near the start of the video, guys, we also had this thing. Dolo Tonight and Roblox. I think Dolo Tonight is like an artist which blew up off TikTok. I think. I'm not too sure, though. Apparently, he now has his own Roblox game called Dolo Tonight and Roblox back to earth which i'm guessing is his album name or song name i'm not too sure i don't really know a lot about this artist to be honest but yeah updated three days ago i guess this event is also coming soon now i did check out the guy's profile and he was last online one month ago he does have merch and 
other accessories. Maybe he quit Roblox, maybe he's coming back. Honestly, guys, I'm really not too sure. Just keep in mind, no prizes have been found for this event just yet. Finally, guys, I think this video is over. I think that's everything I wanted to show you. Maybe I missed one or two things. There's new stuff getting uploaded all the time, right? I'll be sure to cover those later in the video. So yes, that's it for this video. If you guys enjoyed, as always, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one.